morning, fabulous friends. It is Monday, March 9th. I am 42 years old today. Yes, today is my birthday. And what do I have on my agenda for today on my exciting birthday? Um, nothing. I'm actually going to be finishing up the cleaning process of um, everything from the weekend. I'm going to be stripping my bed down, um, changing sheets. Today is Monday, so I changed sheets. Um, but today, like, I really need to change the sheets on our bed because last week Brian and I were both so sick um, and I didn't want to, like, change the sheets until we were, like, better. We're not exactly 100%, but we are definitely better, which is a good thing. So I'll be changing the sheets in there today and scrubbing everything down um, and sanitizing everything in our bedroom because I want to get rid of all the nasty germs that we left in there last week. So um, right now I'm uploading my video from the weekend and I wanted to explain to you guys which you'll get the explanation. Well, I didn't really explain it a lot in the video. I didn't explain anything in the video. I kind of explained it in the description of the video on my channel. Um, the video is like 29 minutes long. And the reason why it's like 29 minutes long, obviously I don't want to bore anybody, but I wanted to, I was vlogging a little bit last week, like Monday and Tuesday I vlogged. And um, I wanted to share with you guys that footage because you know then it was like a waste of footage so I didn't want to waste that footage so I shared that with you guys and then Wednesday I took a turn for the worst and I got really sick and I ended up with a fever so I didn't do anything Wednesday or Thursday because I was just like down for the count I was in bed I couldn't even find enough energy to get up and do anything and decorate which was so disappointing because I had a party to plan for um, so I take you through Monday and Tuesday, I skip over Wednesday and Thursday, obviously because I didn't vlog at all, and then I jump right into Friday, and then Friday prep, Saturday prep, Saturday party, and then Sunday, yesterday, um, a little bit of volleyball game that I didn't play, and then, um, at the very end of the video is, um, a cute little slideshow of some of the pictures that were taken, um, that were taken at the party, two of which were taken by my neighbor um, who made them look very, very vintage, which is so cool. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys can stick around long enough to watch that video. I, like I said, I know that it's lengthy, um, but it's really, really worth it because I really wanted to share with you guys like my week last week and then like what led up to the party and, and all that good stuff. So I still have a few things to clean up here. Um, I'm down to this last little bit to wash, and um, yeah, which that this belongs to my friend Hillary, so I have to get that washed and then like get that back to her. Um, this is washed. I just have to dry that and put it away. These are washed. I have to put these away. Um, those are my pretty little flowers again. And then um, again, I still have to. I'm gonna throw this stuff away. I'm keeping that though. Um, these go to my neighbor, Sandy, and uh, everything else is pretty much together, you know, back to normal. Oh, I have all these to clean, too. I have those to clean. Um, everything is pretty much back to normal um, around here. Um, just a few things that I still have to get done. Like, I really need to mop this floor because it is kind of sticky in here, and people were all over this floor in here, so... Um, there's a lot of markings and stuff on the floor, so I want to make sure that I get this mop today. Um, and, oh, and the front porch I have to clean off too. Yeah, so I have a lot, I have a lot more to do today than I thought that I did. Um, and it being my birthday and all, gah, I have to do everything on my birthday. But, whatever, keeps me busy. Um, so yeah, so now I'm just going to start stripping my bed and getting all that stuff off and fresh sheets and a clean clean bed so i'm excited about that and that's it so i will catch back up with you guys later and talk to you guys soon hello Bye. so i um have uh, folded some clothes i've been doing laundry most of the day washing towels change the sheets on my bed um i went to zaxby's and picked up a 
um, buffalo salad for my lunch. I've just kind of been nibbling on it um, while I'm cleaning stuff and getting everything done. I've finally put away all of this stuff over here um, in the kitchen and put things back where they belong. I have my Swiffer out. Um, I've cleaned all of these trays and I need to put these away. So I'm just gonna put them in here in the dining room so I know to put those away. I cleaned off all the other stuff in the dining room um, like I said before, I think these ones go to my friend Sandy, this one goes to my friend Hillary, and I just have to put those away. And then I don't know what to do with those bottles yet. Um, I started sweeping the floor in here a little bit. I have a pile that I have to um, suck up. I noticed a, I have a gold piece over there that needs to be picked up. And I don't know why these flowers are like so wilty. They need to like stay together so they're pretty. But you know, aren't they beautiful though? And they're so pretty and they like fit so well over here in my little spring area and I actually moved my flower sugar and coffee containers over here on this wall um, because it just actually looks really pretty over here blended in with all the Eastery colors the pastel colors and I left the like alcohol stuff over here underneath this um, counter with the coffee and the grinder so that's the stuff I left there, so I'm happy about that. Just got a birthday card from my mother-in-law and some money. So I was happy about that. So sweet of her to do that. Um, I still have to um, finish sucking up the mess over there. I did clean up all the balloons from outside. Um, my husband has to get the lights down that were on the um, that were hanging on the front porch. He has to get all that stuff down. Um, I've cleared off majority of the stuff over there on my fireplace mantle, that little box, um, because the stuff that, a few of the things that were on top of there go back to my neighbor, um, since she donated some stuff for me to decorate, and then, um, I'll have to move that box, um, don't know where yet, <laughs> um, so yeah, I'm coming along really well. I just went to the dryer, to the laundry room to get the towels out of the dryer and they're still just a little bit damp. So I wanted to re-dry those just to make sure that they were perfectly dry. And then um, fold those, put those away, and then continue on with my regular laundry. But um, other than that, it's been a great day. Okay, this clock, I've changed it like three times now, and I don't know if it's the battery, because I put like a battery in it, and yeah, I'm gonna have to try that again. So I'm gonna have to try to find another battery for that clock, because it's not keeping time like it's supposed to, and I don't know if I have any more, oh, here's one. So I'm gonna try to change this clock, because it, it keeps saying it's only 10 after 12, and it's not, no, it's saying it's, yeah, it's saying it's 10 after 12, what is it saying? Yes, is it saying it's 10 after 12? Yes, it's saying it's 10 after 12. <laughs> and it's not. It's 2.30. So I'm going to fix this clock. Alrighty, so I've put these two batteries in. It only takes one. And these are like, I guess, were supposed to be brand new batteries. But I put them in the clock and it doesn't work. So I put the battery that was in the clock back in the clock. And it starts to work again. So I don't know what the deal is. So I'm going to let that sit there and try to see if it's going to keep time and see if it works. If it doesn't work, then I guess I have to change the battery again and find some fresh batteries, which I thought these were fresh batteries because I kind of keep them in there and obviously I throw away old batteries, but who knows? I don't know why that one is not um, working. I'm debating if I want to go to dinner tonight. <laughs> It's like, I want to because it's my birthday and I'd like to go out to dinner, it'd be nice, but it's like, ugh. Then I have to like get dressed and get myself together and I'm kind of just kind of comfortable and, you know, so I don't know. Should I go to dinner tonight? I don't know. Obviously, I couldn't get your guys' yes or no because this isn't going to go up till tomorrow, so... Who knows? So I'm going to give my stuff a little bit longer to dry, and then I'm going to start folding those towels. And in the meantime, I'm just going to sit here and watch Twilight. And, um, yeah, enjoy. I might try to watch, catch up on some of my YouTube videos that I didn't really get to watch this weekend because, uh, you know, I was busy. So, um, anyway, that's that.
So I decided that I just want to stay home. I'm not, you know, too you know, concerned about going out for my breakfast, dinner, or whatever the case may be. I just figured I'll stay home and we might go out one day this week or something. Um, I just kind of didn't feel like getting dressed or anything like that. I mean, if I was dressed and I was filming other videos and stuff today, then I probably wouldn't have a big problem with it. But just because I'm... I'm just not dressed and ready to go anymore. I just don't feel like going. So I'm not going to, but thanks for hanging out with me guys today. I hope you guys, I hope I didn't bore you guys at all with my such an exciting life that I have had today. Um, but thanks guys for watching anyway. Like, share, and subscribe if you know somebody who might like this video. Uh, make sure you follow me on my Instagram page, Twitter, and my Facebook page, Fabulously 40s. Thanks guys so much for watching. Talk to you tomorrow. Stay fabulous. Bye.